Yo, what's up? Ah? Hey, 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 what's happening? What's up, my friend? Hey, you get a little bit of tour of my home right now. But well, what, what's up, my friend? What's going on? This is your boy Chris coming to you live from the Dallas Fort Worth Metroplex. And hey, I just want to pop on really quick to share some nuggets with you. I want to give you five secrets to put your business growth on autopilot. So let's just walk outside here and, 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 and take a little walk. You, you want to know how way you can guarantee success in your business. Hey, appreciate that love coming through. Appreciate that love. Guys, feel free to like this, share this, and uh, and also show your boy some love. You know, But like it, share it, and comment below where, you, where you're chiming in from. But really quick, would you like to know? A way you can guarantee success in your business. Hey, what's up, Amity? You want to, you know, a way you can guarantee success in your business? You want to know that? Well, before before we talk about the five secrets, let me, let me give you three things you can do right now. No matter where you are right now in your business, the three things that I did in my business, you know, that pretty much can guarantee success. And I can guarantee if you do these three things really quick, you can guarantee success in your business. What's the first thing? Ah, uh, excuse me. First thing it should be obvious, but you got to change the way you think. Uh, a lot of folks want to get into entrepreneurship, but the mindset, hey, 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 Emmett, how you doing? How you doing? Uh, first thing you got to do is change your thinking. Uh, one thing I've noticed, and I noticed this with a lot of solopreneurs, you know, now I'm starting to deal with a lot of uh, off-base business owners, you know, and, and they think a little bit differently than I noticed with solo, solopreneurs, you know, like coaches, consultants, uh, online marketers, or network marketers, you know, solopreneurs think a little bit different than traditional business owners and and if you are a solopreneur and i'm a solopreneur but if you are you got to change the way you think one thing you have to do is you gotta you gotta stop looking at everything as a cost when it comes to growing your business everything you do in your business my friend it's no cost it's an investment so any dollar you invest any uh time you put in the energy is always an investment and as a business owner realize that everything you do is always going to bring a return on your investment so the number one thing you have to do is change the way you think. Most re the number one reason why 97% of solopreneurs fail is because of the way they think. Second thing you got to do really quick, my friend, I appreciate that love, is you got to get clarity. And it's actually uh, kind of talk about one of the main secrets that um, I'm going to give you a free gift with here in about 30 seconds, uh, 45 seconds now. But you got to get clarity. Where are you going in your business? You know, I mean, do you actually know where you're going? You know, uh, most people, Run their business this kind of way. They hope they get lucky. Most people, they're not clear where they're going. They don't know the purpose in life. They, they don't have a vision. They're just trying to make money. And listen, if you're trying to build a successful business and all you focus on is making money, you're gonna fail sooner than what you think. You gotta have, a, you gotta be clear in your direction. You know, you, you gotta know exactly where you're going, what your purpose is. You know, God created everybody with a purpose in life. And so you gotta know, wh why are you here? And why are you in business? It's, it's, it got to be bigger than just making money, right? And so you got to be very crystal clear and know where you're going. So that way, everything you do, every, you know, every investment you make, every choice you make to go here, to go or, or go there, or, or go to this meeting, or, or go to this seminar, or not, it has to be based off of your direction of where you're going. So, because here's the deal: if you don't know where you're going, there's other people out there who are gonna, who are gonna have you going the way they want to go. It's just like if you have no goals. Other folks got goals for you, all right? So you got to be clear. And, and the third thing really quick, you got to get help. Uh, you cannot build a successful business on your own. You understand what I'm saying? If you could, you would already have done it by now. You know, it's a lot of pride and a lot of ego. I, I noticed this. I noticed this. But 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 the, the more broker I, that I was, you know, the more broke I was, the more I failed in business, the more and more pride and ego I had. Didn't make any freaking sense, right? Why? Because I feel like I don't need nobody telling me what to do. I don't need a mentor. I don't need a coach. I, I don't. I don't need to invest in anybody. I don't need help. I don't need to hire. No, I can do this myself. Why? Because I'm super Chris, right? It could be the stupidest thing that you ever do. It's trying to build a business by yourself. You can't. You know, you can go to YouTube all day long, try to watch all the free videos all you want. You, you can try to hop on every single free webinar on planet Earth. But I promise you, you're never going to build a successful business that way. You got to get help. Everybody who's successful always got help. And, and you should want to get help. You know, you understand what I'm saying? You should want to get help. You don't, did you get in your business to be a slave to it? You know, a lot of folks, most folks don't start a business to be a slave to it. Most folks start a business 
because they wanted some type of freedom, right? Fulfillment, something, right? Joy out of it, right? Well, if you if, if you don't have help, if you don't invest in yourself to get help, and help could be coaching, mentoring, training, uh, shucks, using the right tools, and anything you can use to grow your business that you don't have to trade your time for. Because I don't know about you, but time is way more important than money to me. Time is way more important than money. Why? Because that's, that's the most precious gift, asset that God has given me. You know what? I can make more money. You and I can make more money. But you know what we can't make more of? That's time. So that's the one place that you should never shortchange yourself when it comes to your business. So if you do those three things right there, I guarantee you will hit success. You know, if, if you change your thinking, number one, which is huge. And then it's, uh, what I said, get clarity. You got to be clear on where you're going. Then you got to get help. So you got to get help, my friend. So I mean, hopefully you guys are finding, finding this valuable because most folks are struggling because of this. I'm telling you, and they pride in the, most people pride and ego outweigh their bank account. Most people pride and ego. I, I see it all. I have people come to my Facebook group, right? I got a Facebook group called the Online Marketing Domination. If you're not a part of it, you, you should be a part of it. And people come there, and they come there to spam. And I say, listen, I'm sorry, but this, 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 isn't a group, this is not a group for spamming. This is a group for learning how to be a professional marketer online. You know, grow your business online as a professional. And then they get pissed off and mad. I, I say, you know what? I, I will send you a free training that will, that will give you some tips on how to grow your business. Do you want it? They're like, no, I don't want it. I'm like, you're struggling, you're broke, and you're spamming. And I'm trying to help you grow your business by giving you some free tips and training and you're proud of your ego because I wouldn't accept your spammy post in my group cause you to say, no, I don't want your help. I don't, I don't need your help. It's crazy. It's crazy. I, mo, listen, stop letting your pride and ego outweigh your bank account. I'll say it one more time. Stop allowing your pride and ego to outweigh your bank account. Swallow your pride and ego. So, listen, I've been running my mouth, but I got a, I got a free gift for you guys. If you guys want to know the five secrets, to putting your business growth on autopilot. If, if you do, if you do, let me know. Comment right now because you, you guys been checking me out. I've been appreciating. I'm appreciating this. Uh, you check out the 3M show. You know, I like, I like to share with you marketing, mindset, and motivational strategies to help you become an entrepreneur. God created you to be. If you want, I got a free gift for you guys. It's a. It's called a five secrets to putting your to five secrets to business. What is it called? I'm telling you, five secrets to put your business growth on autopilot. That's why I take notes because you know what, you got to get help. See, I, I practice what I preach. Five secrets to put your business growth on autopilot. It's actually uh, something I put together for you. I think you're going to enjoy it. So you're a business owner. If you're an entrepreneur and you want to know the five secrets to put your business growth on autopilot, I'm going to give it to you for free. Yeah, why? Because I'm cool like that. So so if you want that, comment below right now. Uh, this, I want this, Chris. And also like and share this video. Let me see some shares coming through. Let me see some likes coming through. Show your boy some love, y'all. Stop being stingy with the love. Show your boy some love. Hit the share button as well. I'm about to give you guys this. We're going to get the five secrets to put your business growth on autopilot. And, uh, but don't keep this all to yourself. But all you need to do is this. Let me see some love. I don't see no love coming through. I don't see no thumbs up. I don't see no love. I'm trying to hook you guys up. So show your boy some love. Open. Right open. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, show your boy some love. So what, what you need to do is this. Go to iEnjoyMarketing.com forward slash, I wrote it down, so I don't forget. So I enjoy marketing.com forward slash biz growth secrets dot html. Let me say that to you one more time. You, you can go get access to five secrets of putting your business growth on autopilot by going to I enjoy marketing.com forward slash B I Z G R O W T H S E C R E T S dot H T M L. You can go there right now and get access to that, guys. And uh, why? Because I'm just cool like that. So, hopefully, you enjoyed today's impromptu 3M show. I've been working on some new projects. Like I said, I'm starting to work with some uh, uh, newer clients now, some more traditional business owners. So, working on some, some newer things. So, and uh, so, got, got some big things in the works. So, uh, but hope you found this valuable. You know, if you did, like it, share it, comment below what you find most valuable about today's 3M show. And the uh, key thing is, is implement what I say. Because I tell my clients and students this all the time. 
I'm wasting my breath by teaching and training you on how to grow a business online. I said, I, I've done it. I said, but you got to do it. I said, I got other clients and students have done it, but here's the deal. You got to do it. At the end of the day, if you don't implement anything I teach or share, what's the whole point? I know you hear just to you know, see my good looks and hear my Texas twang and all that good stuff, you know. But no, the point is this. You have to implement. So, so go ahead, go download that, my friend, and take action. And remember this, my friend. You two, you two deserve to be free. But more importantly, guys, put God first in all that you do. Put God first. And don't chase after money. Chase after God. I'm going to say that one more time. Do not chase after money. Chase after God. Because you put God first, he can give you the money. But you got to put him first in all that you do. All right? Peace and God bless, guys. I'm a holla. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to go. All right? Peace. Any questions, comment below. All right. Peace.